Marco and Harry could even be learning the cottage for free. Mr. Sheep said, The thing we don't know about this is quite how the financial arrangements are between Eugenie and Jack and Harry and Megan. It could be heated off. Miss Bowie added, I know, but on the flip side, it is vacant, and wouldn't you rather have someone looking after it? I don't think that we are paying rent, which is interesting. I've seen a couple of reports of that. And I think where it seems logical for me, the pandemic must have thrown such a wrench into things, especially when you're about to become a baby. Originally, there was Kensington Palace, but I think logistically, this seems all seems a smart decision as well. We all relocate during this pandemic. Miss Fiorito added, I agree, and Fort McCartage is really big. If they are staying in one part of the house and Harry and Meghan come back from California and want to stay, I'm sure there's a wing of rooms of them. ITV Royal Rhoda hosts Chris Sheep and Lizzie Robinson have also discussed whether Meghan says Eugenie not paying rent to Prince Harry and Meghan Markle to stay at Frogmore, which says Eugenie is thought to be not to be paying rent to Prince Harry and Meghan Markle to stay at Frogmore Cottage. Princess Eugenie is 30 and Jack Bruce Bang 34 have moved into Frogmore Cottage while Megan Marco and Prince Harry are in LA. Robert Royal Expert, the Omid Scobie, said that property is on loan and the Duke and Duchess of Sussex plan to stay at their UK home when they return. But Royal Commanders Robert of Florida and Rachel Bowie believe that Eugenie is staying at their rent free. Speaking on Royal Tea Obsessed, Mr. Fiorito said, It feels weird to me because they only just have it on earth because we've got this nice big Netflix deal. Or it could be please pay us whatever pounds per month. Uh, so this arrangement is going to be quite interesting. According to sources in the office, the successes have planned to return to UK soon after the April departure. However, the plans were delayed due to the coronavirus pandemic.